Missiles flew, drones struck. But the most dangerous part of the war, you didn't see it. Welcome to the new Battle of the Giants, where code is deadlier than bullets. In mid-June, Israel launched Operating Rising Lion, a wave of military strikes. Iran hit back with drones and missiles. But while the headlines focused on explosions, another war was already underway, which is a cyber war. It began back in 2010 with Stuxnet, a silent worm that spun Iran's nuclear centrifuges out of control and disappeared. It was precise, invisible, devastating. Blamed on Israel and the US, it became the world's first a digital weapon of mass destruction. Since then, Iran's become a cyber power in its own right. In 2020, Iranian hackers targeted Israeli water system and Israel responded by shutting down Iran's port networks. But here's where it gets bigger. Behind the screens is a superpower tech wall. The US is blocking China from accessing cutting-edge chips. Meanwhile, China is building its own tech stack and quietly backing Iran. Now, Chinese tech keeps Iran online and trading despite sanctions. Israeli cyber firms backed by Washington and the Pentagon. So this isn't just Iran versus Israel. It's part of a global fight for digital dominance. And the next war, it might not shut down a city with bombs, but with code from a laptop.